What happens to your body when you drink coffee every day? Good afternoon dear viewer. The most useful and interesting information just for you. I wish you all goodness, happiness, love and a peaceful sky. So let's go. The article was professionally consulted with Dr. Voha Bang Siwang, General Internal Medicine, Department of Examination and AMD. Internal Medicine, the Mekfukwok International General Hospital. Coffee is a familiar daily drink of the majority of the population. People often start the day with a cup of coffee to increase alertness. You can easily find coffee shops. You must have wondered more than once, how coffee affects the body and when you drink it every day, what happens to your body? We will discuss with you that coffee is not completely good and not completely bad for health. What matters is how you use it effectively. 1. Caffeine Addiction If Drinking Coffee Every Day Drinking a cup of coffee first thing in the morning can feel incredibly magical sometimes, especially if you're particularly stretched that day. But be careful if you find yourself doing it every day as you could get addicted. The reason for that addiction is that coffee competes with adenosine receptors in the brain. Adenosine is a sleep inducer. The body adapts by creating more adenosine receptors, so people who drink coffee every day still sleep normally. As a result, your energy levels drop and you need coffee just to combat withdrawal symptoms. Those symptoms can include irritability, headaches, and exhaustion. To avoid that, experts recommend cycling to prevent tolerance buildup if you drink coffee every day. 2. Drinking coffee every day keeps you awake and reduces depression. In addition to the effect of competing with adenosine receptors in the brain to keep the body awake, coffee also increases neurotransmitters such as dopamine and norepinephrine. This reduces fatigue and increases alertness. That's not the only positive effect drinking coffee every day can have on your mood. According to a study, it has been shown to be less prone to depression. 3. Supports weight loss if you drink coffee every day. Coffee can also help you lose weight by improving physical performance during exercise. It also helps your body absorb and burn the fatty acids in your blood. The bigger influence on your health is eating a balanced diet, exercising and maintaining a healthy weight. Drinking coffee should only be a supplement to those important health factors. 4. If you drink coffee every day in the afternoon, your sleep will be disrupted. Drinking coffee every day is a pretty normal habit, especially when you only drink a cup or two right after waking up. But if you are drinking coffee in the afternoon, you may find yourself struggling with insomnia. You will not sleep well or not sleep at night if you drink coffee in the afternoon. Caffeine has a long half-life of 6 hours, if you drink your coffee at 2 p.m., half of the caffeine from that cup is still active at 8 p.m. So avoid drinking coffee in the late afternoon. If you find yourself unable to sleep at night, try adjusting your coffee intake only in the morning. After all, coffee is no substitute for actual sleep. 5. You can become agitated if you drink coffee every day. Coffee disrupts your sleep, depending on your physiology, drinking too much caffeine, at any time of day, can cause other negative health effects. So, if you feel restless, agitated, anxious or nervous, or having a panic attack, cut back on your coffee intake as soon as possible. Choosing to drink coffee every day can be the main cause of some mental instability if you have never drank coffee before either. Avoid drinking too much coffee during the day and stop drinking coffee when there are any signs of bad effects on health. 6. Coffee helps prolong life. Some studies show that coffee drinkers over the age of 50 have a reduced risk of premature death compared with non-coffee drinkers. This may be explained by other benefits associated with coffee such as oxidation, excitement in life, work. Coffee is one of many things that healthy people drink every day. 7. Drinking coffee every day reduces the risk of type 2 diabetes. Diabetes is increasing in the population. The consequences of type 2 diabetes are other health problems. Studies that have analyzed the association between daily coffee consumption and diabetes have shown that coffee consumption is associated with a reduced risk, even when the coffee is decaffeinated. Deciding to drink coffee every day doesn't sound too bad. 8. 
When you drink coffee every day, you boost your antioxidant levels. Antioxidants are an important component of your diet. They help minimize any potential harm to the body caused by free radicals. Foods that contain antioxidants are good for your health. Coffee contains high levels of antioxidants. When you drink coffee daily, you increase your levels of protective antioxidants. This is good news for those who have a daily coffee habit. 9. You can protect your brain from disease by drinking coffee every day. Some studies show that coffee use seems to have some correlation with a reduced risk of developing Alzheimer's and Parkinson's disease. Interestingly, it's not the caffeine in coffee that provides this benefit. Instead, it's the presence of a compound called phenylindanes, which increases when coffee beans are roasted, that help protect the brain from toxic proteins that contribute to brain disease. 10. Drinking coffee every day can increase memory. Not only can serious diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's be avoided, but drinking coffee every day can also help your brain. In addition, drinking your daily coffee can help boost your memory. Some reviews in this regard point out, caffeine has a cognitive enhancing effect, but its particular effect in consolidating memories and making them resistant to forgetfulness has never been studied in detail in humans. 11. Drinking coffee every day is good for the liver. Another benefit of coffee is good for the liver. Choosing to drink coffee every day can protect you from liver disease. Specifically, if you drink alcohol regularly but also drink 1 to 4 cups of coffee a day, your chances of developing cirrhosis are significantly reduced, according to Dr. Arthur L. Kladsky, a Cassier Permanente researcher. Coffee consumption appears to have some protective benefit against alcoholic cirrhosis, he revealed in an interview with The Guardian. And the more coffee a person consumes, the less likely they are to be hospitalized or die of alcoholic cirrhosis. 12. Drinking unfiltered coffee daily can raise cholesterol levels. Drinking filtered coffee every day will not harm you or raise your LDL cholesterol. Avoid drinking coffee that has not been used through a filter paper. Studies show that drinking unfiltered coffee regularly increases cholesterol levels. 13. Drinking coffee during pregnancy will have adverse effects on the health of mother and baby. Pregnant women must take good care of their health during pregnancy, including maintaining a healthy diet. Unfortunately for coffee lovers, caffeine may not be the best thing for you while you're pregnant. Coffee will affect your mood, usually your psychology has also changed during pregnancy. Besides, coffee also increases your heart rate, so you will feel more tired. High amounts of caffeine can harm an unborn baby. Because the fetus cannot metabolize caffeine very well. Therefore, there may be negative effects on the fetus, causing the fetus to absorb less nutrition, causing malnutrition, low birth weight so for women who are pregnant, although the evidence cannot yet conclusion, but we recommend limiting your coffee intake during this stage of life. It is probably only for the best if pregnant women decide not to drink coffee every day and avoid certain other beverages. 14. How much coffee should you drink per day? With all the information available about coffee and its impact on your health, it can be difficult to figure out how much coffee you should drink each day. If you are a normal healthy person, you can drink daily, 1-2 to two cups day. Do not drink too much coffee during the day. If you experience symptoms of being intoxicated with coffee, reduce your coffee intake. If you have any medical conditions, talk to your doctor when deciding to drink coffee every day. The Neck International General Hospital is one of the hospitals that not only ensures professional quality with a team of leading medical doctors, modern equipment and technology, but also stands out for its examination and consultation services. Comprehensive and professional medical consultation and treatment. Civilized, polite, safe and sterile medical examination and treatment space. Thank you very much for watching. Subscribe, like, leave your comments. I wish you all love, happiness, kindness and a peaceful sky.